Hello Raider Nation, this is Duntoff. Today I am at the new headquarters. It is Monday, November 25th, 2019. It looks like they got a lot done since I was here last. So you can see they're, they're working on you know, all this, the outside panels. Before they had just the yellow, now they're putting whatever this orange protection is. And then on the south end over here, they're also adding this other covering. So there's a lot of steps to this. That's what these guys are working on here. Okay, I know the last time I was here that this bottom, the first floor, did not have any glass going up. So you can see on this south side of the main building that they got the glass in on this bottom level. See how reflective it is. All right, so the front of the building is looking pretty good. Definitely see how you know, it's got a pretty cool looking design gonna resemble pretty much how the stadium design looks So this part of the building, this is the front, this actually faces east. We go up to the front of the indoor field. You can see we're getting uh, panels on the outside here. It's looking pretty good. I forget on the renderings, but I think right there in the middle of the black will be the Raiders logo. I'm pretty sure that's what it was. And then over here where these guys were working, A lot of truck noise going by. So right here will be the, should say Las Vegas Raiders right inside there where they're working. So let's go see if we can see what these guys All right, so there's one of the panels right there.
see how they do it. Like they go in pretty easy. Yeah, and you can see how high up they are. All right, so we got the main, these are like the construction office buildings here. Of course, we got our Raiders logo. And then behind them again, those are where the outdoor fields are gonna be. And they end right like by this, by the water tank. I don't remember seeing this over here. They got like this curbing. I'm not sure, you know, what that is. If that's just the edge of where the field's gonna be. And this is going to be the locker room training area on the side of the of the indoor field. I can see some guys are up there. I think they're working on the roof, apparently. I'm gonna walk around and get some different angles. All right, I am now on the south side of the headquarters. You can see they're offloading something over here. Not sure what they are. I can't tell from zooming in. New York, so it might be heating and cooling.
See, we got some kind of forms up here on the side. So this is going down the side. This is supposed to be like the locker rooms and training area. It's actually where they're stacking these, the stuff that they're offloading, I think is the heating and air. This whole area, these are where the three outdoor fields are gonna be. be all where you could see like the little bit of gray in the dirt over there those are the outdoor fields and I'm not sure what's gonna be in this little back part of the right behind the indoor field I don't know what that area is supposed to be and we got a bunch of construction guys standing out here I don't know what they're doing all right as you can see on this side there is none of the outdoor panels yet going up the outside panels Pretty big scissor lift they got here. All right, I'm going to do my zoom in on the stadium from here. So it is just north of here, down Interstate 15. And we're gonna swing on around. And then you can see the Las Vegas skyline down there. And right there is the new stadium. I don't know if you could see it on the video, but if you look, when it gets a little bit cool out here, colder, you can see the smog line all around. Usually by like middle of the day, it'll disappear, but the cold air kind of holds it down. All right, so with the stadium and the headquarters here, remember this is a holiday week, Thanksgiving Thursday, so I'm assuming it'll just be a short week that everyone should be off Thursday, Friday for sure. Okay, so that's about 12 miles away and we'll zoom out. There's the view. All right, so that's how they get the panels. I was wondering because it didn't look like there were any more up there. So they bring them up one at a time with the crane.
wind picking up now. It's starting to get pretty windy. This is pretty much the straight on shot to the main entrance of the building. So it is. Let's see if we look inside. We're getting a lot more of the wall studs going in. We got these double, double staircases on each side of the main entrance. weeks ago you can see it in the background here so right there that's the M resort so they announced that they partnered with the Raiders to be the official hotel I don't remember if it was the official hotel of the headquarters or just of the Raiders period but they did say that they are going to have a Raiders bar restaurant that they're going to put in there and have like some memorabilia and stuff like that. So that's about a mile away. It's, if you take, I'm on Executive Airport Drive, you would just follow it up this way heading to the north. And then when you get to St. Rose Parkway, you would go you would go right heading west and it's about a mile down the road it's right at Las Vegas Boulevard and St. Rose Parkway which is close to the Interstate 15 so that's another one of the many partnerships that they're setting up all right this is the crane they're using to lift the panels up That's a panel right there. Yeah, looks like a whole bunch of them. All right, and you can see a little bit down this north side. All right, again, to between the orange panels, you could see the glass on the main building. And then it connects with the design on the indoor field. So I'm not sure if it's going to be glass on the indoor field or not, but I would think so. Because I would think if it was going to be panels, they would have just put them in just like the rest of them. So this, that should be glass. Okay, then we got the corner office. This maybe is Mark Davis's office. Because they got like an outdoor little balcony area. Because I know I heard before that he wanted one on this side of the building. So we'll see. All right, 
right, so it is starting to get kind of windy out here. And I did notice they got down off of the scaffolding. They lowered it down. The ones, the guys putting up the panel. So I don't know if it's because of the wind or if it's just time for a break. It's about 10.30 in the morning right now. But they did get down and they're not lifting anything. So could be for safety. All right, then you can see the design is pretty cool looking. So this is the north side. So they're pretty much done with the panels here. And you can see how it extends onto that little part of the building that goes off the back side. On this north side this lower level see there's no glass yet you can see inside the main entrance they're gonna more of the walls nation i guess that's all i got for today so if you aren't subscribed and you would like to keep getting updates on this new raiders headquarters as well as the raiders allegiant stadium please subscribe to my channel raiders 1967 and you'll get updates on this and the stadium so thanks for watching and i'll talk to you guys next time